Welcome back. It may be 40 minutes after the hour, but this morning we are gearing up for New Year's Eve. And we are talking about party appetizers and pairings. Joining us this morning, Jordan, De Jordan DeChambre from Black Sheep. Good morning. Hi. So good to see you again. You as well. Thanks so much for coming in. Now, when people think about New Year's, they probably think about some really pretty basic pairings of food, but this they really is do. a little something different. It really is. And I mean, I think New Year's so often is referred to as kind of amateur night, right? <laughs> like, it's, if you never go out, that's the night you go right. out. And I think you can really change that perception by doing something new and different. So it isn't the general five course meal, okay. or maybe you're going out and having lobster. Mm -hmm. Make it fun. You know, make it something new. Have it be an adventure. You're kicking off a new year. That's what it's all about. An adventure. We love that. Exactly. What are we starting with here? So we're going to start over here. We're going to talk a little bit about wine and hot dog pairings, okay. which are something that's a little bit irreverent mm -hmm. and very black sheep. Um, and we've been doing for a while. And what we love about wine and hot dog pairings is it's all about opposites attract. Okay. So if you look at something, we have our Wooster dog here, mm -hmm. which is an amazing hot dog with arugula and blue cheese. Now, the blue cheese is very rich and mm -hmm. the arugula is very peppery. Right. So we like to pair it with a Tuscan blend that has a little bit more of a smooth finish. Oh, okay. It definitely kind of balances out, you know, what's happening with the Wooster dog. Okay. And this looks delicious, by the way. I, I know. It no smells so smell good. It. I know. <laughs> Right? <laughs> and then this is the white here. Yes. Mm -hmm. So as we move into the whites, we're thinking a little bit more about, you know, how we can balance the idea of fruity flavors with spicy flavors. Okay. So we have our Armada dog here, which is actually a green chorizo sausage from oh. Underground Meats. It's mm -hmm. amazing. And mm -hmm. red onions, mint, cilantro, a little uh, lime zest crema. There's some fabulous things happening with this, and it really balances well with a light and fruity Sauvignon Blanc. Okay. Yeah. Wow, there's a lot of textures in that. Lots so of way. texture. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Lots of flavor. Mm -hmm. And finally? Finally, the bubbly. Yeah. So that's, that's where my heart <laughs> lies always. Give me the boob and I'm happy. So here, we're doing a really fun combination. This is about as irreverent and different as it can possibly get. We have our trailer park dog, uh -oh. which is, you know, my personal favorite. It has this great coleslaw, mm -hmm. and it's a bacon-wrapped hot dog, Velveeta cheese. I mean, it is like glutton. It's amazing. It's so amazing. And then we're pairing it with what would traditionally be kind of a... You know, more of an upscale drink when we're thinking about champagne, we type, you know, think about aspirational things. Right. So we're really kind of pairing these things together, and the, the fizziness and the lightness of the Vouv really balances the tanginess of the coleslaw. Wow, that is completely opposite to track. Really My goodness, pretty yeah. interesting. Well, Jordan, thank you so thank much. You. We appreciate that. If you would like to learn more about Black Sheep, we have put that information on our website, wisn.com. You will find it under the On TV section.